get them. They won't get away. Empty. Damn it. All right. Where's Van Yu? That's a pretty kid. Who's the father? Huh? Speak up now.
No, don't do it, please. Well, talk. Where are they? What are you doing here? I guess that one small boy is as much as you scum can handle. Get lost. Hey! Me, me, sir? Did these rats hurt you very badly? No, sir. Because if they did, then I'll cut the whole damn lot into little pieces. Make you some hot dogs, all right?
Are you all right? Yes, thanks. I'm quite all right. Who's that? Oh, he's just a local pickpocket. My lord, I've come in to report, sir. How many did you get? Seven so far, sir. We've got them all in jail now. Fan Yun and Chen Lin, what about them? Uh, they're almost certainly dead, I'm sure. Uh, the bodies? Uh, maybe swept out to sea, no trace. My lord. So they got away. Is that right? We didn't find them. But the boat was completely burnt out. If... If, if they were hiding on it, they'd been burnt to death. most important members in the movement. You must get them. It's your job. Well, if they did get away, they'll be in Hong Kong. I'll take some men and get them. Don't underestimate the support that they have. And Hong Kong's British, so watch it. I'm not expecting that much trouble with a few of my men. There'll be no problems. Hmm. I might come with you. I could use a break. Sir. I'm just a teacher, not a politician. Uncle, but none of us are really expecting that you'll join our movement. All that we want is that you help us a bit as long as we're in Hong Kong. Drink your tea. Mm. Brother, please let them stay with us. I'll be responsible. Teacher. Teacher. There's a fellow named Chen. He wants to see you. Oh? Ask him in. Right. I think you'd all better keep out of sight. Yes, you're right. We'll go. I know why you've come, and I'm quite flattered. But still, I've retired from fighting contests, so I can't oblige you. Oh, I see. 
I've come a long way for a match with you. You should oblige me. Unless it worries you. I mean, it wouldn't look too good if I did happen to beat you. In front of all your pupils, too. You! Think what you want. I'm sorry. I'm busy. I have to go. Hmm. You want to fight? Well, all right. I came here for a contest with the famous Mr. Wong, that's all. So step aside, please. You got a lot of that. You're very good. But still, huh? Pitchy. your men against those two seems unfair <laughs> Say our skins. They would have killed us for sure. Well, what's happened to all this bravery that you revolutionaries are supposed to have? Huh? huh? <laughs> Look you. Just back from America. I had my cue cut there. Could you help us? We're going to Wong's Martial Arts School. Mr. Wong? Yeah. Tell me, are you connected with him? No, we're not. He brought us to the door. He said that he'd been here once before today. He wouldn't come in. That's right. He said he'd been in the States.
Listen! We found two more, but they're both dead! Hong Kong's arrived. That's why he spared these. It's just his way of warning us. Otherwise, he'd kill them too. Hello, Hong Kong. Years ago, I lived in Canton. I had trouble with Hong Kong there, and we fought. And he beat me. You of here has taught a lot of people with its time. You've killed someone today. Hmm. Quite a few. My lord, the ship from Singapore is arriving tomorrow. Sun Yat-sen's agent may be on it. He'll be seeing Fan Yun. All right, I'll arrange to get him. What about this fellow who's come from America? He could give us some trouble. I'd like to have your permission to bring one of my guns down here from Canton. Bring the gun to Hong Kong? All right. <laughs> but don't get into trouble with the British.
He's a well-known pickpocket. Hey, Fenyan. Fenyan, I'd like to be a member of your movement. You see, I've cut my cue off. Oh? How do you know who I am? Hong Kong's a very small place and you're quite well known. Hmm. And what's your name? My name is Lin Si. I heard you just arrived from Canton. <laughs> Listen, please let me join. Let me be a member of your movement. You're sure that you want to join? Sure. Listen, if you're caught, they'll show you no mercy. They'll just execute you. That doesn't matter. We've got to throw out the chains. And if I do happen to get caught, well, then I die. Good. Then I'll give you an introduction. Go to the martial arts school and ask for Mr. Shen or else for Mr. Wong. Oh, thank you. Thanks a lot. Uh, I'm very grateful to you for this. <laughs> This is the new national flag of China. Comrades, our movement's gaining strength. We haven't achieved our final goal as yet, but still, we're gaining in experience all the time. So soon... No, oh, wait. Comrade, I heard from Shen Li. He couldn't shake off that guy. So he thought he'd better go back to the school. Who are you? <laughs> what do you want? I want you.
命。Is Shen Lee still at the school? Hey! Talk! Talk!
I have a letter from Comrade Fenn. Oh? Are uh, you a friend of his? Oh, sure, I'm a friend of his. We've known each other for many years. Oh! Uh, come in! <laughs> who came down here from Canton? Uh, uh, I don't know. I, uh, I don't know nothing here at all. Talk! I know nothing. I... Sir? Where's Wang Yi? Wang? Wang? Wang Yi! No, I, I don't know. can assure you that we will do our best. Thanks.
<laughs> Comrade? That's the best the famous Mr. Wang can do. It's not much. Listen to me! killed them. Please calm down. Now listen. He just found his brother and his students lying dead. He didn't know what he was doing. Wouldn't you have been the same? And you? I know it wasn't you. But I'd have known that anyway. You wouldn't be capable of it. Go back now. Talk things over with him. Discuss things. Huh? Sorry. He could never trust me now. I see. Neither do you trust us. I have my own plans. I'm going after Ann Kang myself. Wang Yi. Wang Yi, you can either be a rich man, or else you can die right now. Well? I... I don't want anything except to be just an honest man. And dead? <clears throat> Even that. I'd rather be dead than like you.
Why didn't you tell me? Oh. Is Eagle back yet? Not yet. I got men looking for him now. My lord. What's wrong? Long schools from the policemen. Your appeal's there too. They've been taking out the corpses, including that of your pickpocket friend. Where's Eagle? I don't know. But somebody heard a gunshot. I don't like to say it, but it looks as if Sir. Two Europeans came today. They said that they knew you were in Hong Kong. Or they said, if you make any trouble. Well then, or they said, they wouldn't have any option but to arrest you. That's all. Uh, they said your position wouldn't protect you. So please be careful. My lord. Come in. There's a letter just arrived, sir. It's supposed to have something to do with Eagle. Hmm. Go back to Canton. Tell the military advisor to come straight away. Sir. Huh. A damn British. I'm holding your assistant. If you want him back, come to Deep Bay tomorrow at 8, Chen Fung.
to throw out the chains and people like you. That's what I mean. <laughs>
Get you both! <laughs> Won't you do this? Yeah, and a girl too.
Are you Chen Feng? A little present for you with my compliments. Additionally, I have your girlfriend. Meet me at Castle Peak tomorrow at 8. Hong Kong.